Today's video is about Thanksgiving and kidney disease and what you can do to help protect your kidneys from eating a lot of the food you don't normally eat, from overeating, and from eating and drinking all these things that you hopefully don't normally do. That's what this video is about. If you're looking about uh, have a kidney friendly Thanksgiving, what you should choose, what you should pick, we're not really going to discuss that. There's a lot of other videos. This video is going under the assumption that it's a time of the year where you tend to overeat, where most people tend to overeat, drink things they don't eat. So how are we going to protect our kidney from all that sodium, protein, phosphorus? So that's what this video is about. So thanks for watching. This is Healthy Kidney Inc. Check out our website, like, subscribe, comment. So hopefully you have a good Thanksgiving. You're spending it with people you want to, friends, family and you're gonna enjoy it. And you know that you're gonna overeat. You're gonna have a lot more sodium, protein, fats. Maybe you're gonna drink alcohol or drink uh, sugary beverages, have things you don't normally have. And we know that this can damage the kidney, especially a large amount at one time. We know uh, shows kidney damage because you're just hitting that kidney with so much to do, so much toxin, so much acid buildup from all those animal proteins, acidic foods. So we want to protect that kidney. So what can you do first? So everything we're talking about here is done the day before, day of, and day after. If you see the video on the day of Thanksgiving, that's fine. You do it that day of and the day after. If you see it after Thanksgiving, you do it the day after. If you plan on eating a lot of those leftovers in that diet for a little while, then you might want to take these for a little bit longer. So what do you want to do? Make sure you take all your meds. Take your phosphorus binders, very important. But get a little sodium bicarbonate, baking soda. If you don't take it, take a little. Uh, if you do take it, take a little more because that will blunt all the acid buildup that's coming in from all those acidic foods. So do that day before, day of, day after, and longer if you're going to eat a lot of other healthier foods. Two supplements to take, okay? Vitamin C and vitamin E. One pill each, day before, day of, day after, etc. Now, what vitamin E and vitamin C do is they show to blunt the effects of the high fats, the high fat diets, the high fat foods that are coming in. So that's going to help your body, help your kidneys, um, and protect from some of that antioxidant, that cell damage that comes along with all that, all those foods. Also, hydration, drink a lot so you keep urinating um, so that whatever's coming in from all those foods, you can get rid of it, a lot, a lot of it through urinating. So... Do those four things and you're gonna help protect your kidneys. There's more things you can do. You can take CoQ10, you can take other antioxidants, but these are the four basic, the main ones that'll definitely help support good kidney health. As you're enjoying your Thanksgiving, eating all those other foods that hopefully you don't eat often. Thanks for watching everybody to your best kidney health and check out our other videos here at Healthy Kidney Inc. and HealthyKidneyInc.com. Bye.